Kirsten, now we're going to put it all together with a golf club. So very important for starters, put your left hand hanging naturally and that's the way you hold the golf club in your left hand and hold it with your right hand, take your grip and basically we're going to try to put all three together, the three power sources, the hands, the arms and the body because that's how you hit to your full potential. So let's see you start a swing, you're going to turn fully, your arms are going to go back fully, you're going to hinge your wrist fully and then as you come through you're going to turn fully and your arms are going to have strength as they go through and your hands are going to turn over. Hands, arms and body, beautiful, hands, arms and body, full and full. Those are the three power sources in the swing. If you're limiting any of those three, I believe that you are hurting your chances of fulfilling your potential power. Hands, arms, and body. Let's see a few hard ones. Down at the ball. Use those hands. She said she had weak hands, but look at this. Boom. That is a good golf swing. Hands, arms, and body. Now real slow. Slow. Slow and through and through and turn those hands, good, and turn that body all the way, all the way. And those of you that are following along, if you don't have a club, you could be holding a spoon or a magazine or something else. You could be doing this with Kirsten right here. Now full and hard, full and hard, come on, full and hard, all the way. Last one as hard as you could and hold that follow through. Folks, that is real golf swing right there. I hope you like this tip and the ones that I post every day. I'd appreciate it if you give me a like, subscribe, and share it with your fellow golfers. Also, follow me on social media because I want to help you get great at golf.